Question, what's the best way to store lettuce? What's the best way to store iceberg lettuce? What's the best way to store romaine lettuce? And what causes the lettuce to turn brown in the first place? And how come when we buy those pre-mixed salads at the grocery store, they never seem to last very long? Well, we've done the research and we're gonna share the answers to those questions and much more coming up. Well, hi folks, it's Mike with Kitchen Tips Online, your one-stop shop for the best kitchen tips and tricks online. And if you're new here, well, I invite you to subscribe. And also, if you have a kitchen tip or trick that you would like to share, it doesn't have to be about lettuce, but if you have a kitchen tip or trick that you think is great and you would like to share, just put it in the comments section below. And if we use it in a future video, we'll give you a shout out so you can call grandma and say, hey grandma, they're using my tip. Okay, what causes lettuce to turn brown or wilt in the first place? Well, the answer is ethylene gas. Ethylene gas is naturally produced by lettuce and other plants when they start to decay or when the plant thinks that it's been injured, it starts to decay right away. And if you look at the way the manufacturer delivers the product to the grocery store, you can see that it's completely wrapped in plastic. This romaine lettuce is not only in a plastic container, but it actually has a sealed on plastic lid. And the purpose of that is to protect the product from ethylene gas outside sources. For example, Apples give off ethylene gas as they deteriorate. That's why they say one bad apple can spoil the whole bunch, and that's because as it decays, it gives off more ethylene gas, causing the other fruit to ripen. So if we protect this from outside sources of ethylene gas, the lettuce will last longer. And by the way, ethylene gas is also what destroys celery. And if you haven't seen our video on the best way to store celery, we'll put a link to that video at the end of this video. Okay, so what causes that pre-mixed salad, you know, the buy one, get one free, and by the time you get to the free one, it's completely mush or liquid at the bottom, what causes it to deteriorate quicker than, say, if you bought just a plain head of lettuce? Well, the answer to that is the enemy of vegetables, ethylene gas. Now, lettuce gives off ethylene gas, but at a very small rate. When you chop up all those other vegetables and put them in the bag, they deteriorate quicker or decay quicker and give off even more ethylene gas quicker than the lettuce would, causing the lettuce to deteriorate quicker. Okay, what can you do to make your lettuce stay fresh longer in your refrigerator? Well, the answer to that is, take a clue from the manufacturer. Now obviously we have to open this and remove it from the plastic bag. And by the way, you shouldn't remove it from the plastic bag until you're ready to eat it. But once you eat it, you're gonna have some left over. Then you should take and put it into a Ziploc bag, just like this. And remove the air. If you want, you can use a straw. But basically what we're doing is trying to mimic, if you see that, what the manufacturer has done. There is ethylene gas all around us. Cars produce ethylene gas. Your leaves rotting in the yard are a big source of ethylene gas. So the best way to protect your lettuce is to keep the ethylene gas away from it. Well, there you go, folks. Now you know how to store lettuce so that it will last for weeks and you can save some money. And if you think your friends might benefit from this video, please share it with them to help us grow the channel. Thanks for watching.